We've hardly slept for seven nights, or we sleep, but anxiously. My dears, the time will come when we'll be able to sleep, but it'll be after the war, after the victory, in a peaceful country as we need. After the victory, a brand new video message released moments ago from Ukraine's President Vladimir Zelensky. Of course, he's a former comedian who was a political novice, and now he's leading his country in this fight for survival. CNN's Phil Black takes a look at his path to leadership. There's one really good reason why, even in peacetime, many wondered whether Volodymyr Zelensky had what it took to lead his country. His preparation for the job was pretending to lead his country. President Ukraine. In the popular Ukrainian TV show, Servant of the People, he played another unlikely president, a teacher suddenly elevated to the highest office after a private rant about corruption goes viral. In real life, his political party uses the name of the show as its own. Zelensky's showbiz career was all comedy and light entertainment, including playing Paddington Bear in the movie franchise's Ukrainian release. Somehow, that path has led him to the role of wartime president at a perilous moment for his country. Is it fair to say that he was an unlikely presidential candidate and he is a thoroughly improbable wartime leader? I think that is fair to say. He's a man of um, extraordinary achievement and capabilities. Всем доброго ранку, Украинцы. Capabilities widely noticed through his recent example of leadership. Zelensky's videos from the streets of Kiev are being watched everywhere. Calm, determined, insistent the world must do more. And he's provided perhaps the most memorable line of the war so far, responding to a US offer to get him out of Kiev with, the fight is here, I need ammunition, not a ride. And you can be sure that that courage is appreciated and has strengthened his own people and their resolve to deal with this, this, this act of blatant aggression. He could personally make a difference to the outcome, you believe? Oh, there's no doubt about it. Look, he is now an international hero, a living symbol of standing firm against overwhelming odds. But it will not enforce In an exclusive interview with CNN's Matthew Chance, Zelensky played down the personal risks and hardship he's enduring. I'm the president of Ukraine, and I'm not iconic. I think the Ukraine is iconic, and I, 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 I always uh, was sure in it, and I knew it always. I knew it uh, that Ukraine is special country. Ukraine is the heart of Europe. Zelensky has met his foe. He sat across from Vladimir Putin during talks in late 2019. Clearly the junior, vastly less experienced statesman. Now Putin's forces are coming for him. This moment is revealing Zelensky's character as he rallies his people and the world to resist Russia's assault and save Ukraine's democracy. Phil Black, CNN, London.